Deshaun Watson is in town, um, met with the media to give an update on his rehab as well as how he's feeling. We just put a process that can, you know, ramp up and that's just right for, you know, the right timing to come back and be able to be full go. And um, I think in this process right now, it's all about load management and not doing too much, um, even though I probably could. So, um, yeah, we just make sure that we take it a day by day um, and we do exactly what everyone came on, you know, months before, got on that call and we put the plan together just to make sure we're on the right track and stand, you know, stand on the right track and not getting ahead of ourselves. I feel uh, really good. Um, very confident in myself in the process that's going. Shoulder's been really well. Um, so just making sure that I don't do anything extra that's going to harm it or, or, or anything like that. Um, so I think that's the biggest thing. That's exactly what, you know, Dr. Elitrosh and the guys told me is don't try to do anything extra and rush back. So um, just follow this the script and the, and the plan and you'll be exactly where you want to want to be even even better than before. With that, let's welcome in Tim Bielek from The Plain Dealer, Cleveland.com. Um, Tim, all reports, things are on track, things are going well, things are where they need to be. I mean, if, if you're the Browns, you got to be pretty happy with that, you know, considering, you know, just how, how much of a, uh, you know, crushing blow it was at the time when, you know, it was announced that Sean Watson was done for the season. But, you know, I think it's it's, it's important, you know, the Sean Watson, like you said, is sticking to the advice of the doctors, following along with a careful plan, because there's no need to rush things. You're three months plus away from training camp, almost five months away from the start of the regular season. And, you know, with only three preseason games, they're not going to Brazil, you know, Watson could take his time a little bit, kind of work his way back into it, kind of like what you see with pitchers when they rehab. They, you know, kind of have to take their time a little bit. I know it's not – I know it's slightly different throwing a football versus throwing a baseball, but it seems like, you know, Watson – It's he, seeing him say, you know, he, he's confident he feels like where he is, where he, where he's at, I should say, with his shoulder. It's, it's good for the Browns, like I said, that he's kind of, you know, progressing the way he is, that he's able to throw again. And it just, you know, the next couple of months is, you know, how that pitch count, for lack of a better term, improves and how soon, you know, you know, how deep in a training camp before he can really get, you know, go full go with that shoulder.